Hello YouTube and welcome to Groundworks tutorial. Today I will be showing you how to fully customize your bomber crew, uh, plane and crew. So here we are in the bomber crew menu. You get uh, to it. This is an overview and when you press the aircraft you get a chance to come to your, you know, view your aircraft, which is this wonderful Lancaster. Right, so uh, if you go to delivery, this gives you a chance to actually, you know, change colors and stuff. But that you would know on your own, so I won't uh, go into too many details. You can actually change colors, you can change your nose art, like Curve Digital Runner Dock, and you can also drone your own. As you can see, I have a one very badly drawn picture of my logo, Pilot. That you can, if you press customize, you get this pixel editor and you can uh, change colors on pixel by pixel basis, which I personally think it's rather awesome. Right, that's one way how you can actually put, you know, custom logos. And let's keep it installed on this one for the time being. Engine art, you can put like flames, flying tiger and whatnot. You can also put these guys, but they just look hideous. Uh, and you can customize wing art, you, same thing, but note that this custom 1, custom 2, those are basically just uh, one and the same. So same template applied everywhere on the plane. Also you can write the text and it can be black text or the white text. So for example if you wanted to write something really cool then you can put like something like this. And then you can put whatever you want. So, for example, if I wanted to run an advertising campaign for people to support me, I could put like this. Yes, and so every German bomber that would be taking a look at, uh, instead of shooting me, could find me on Patreon and support the channel and join the Ground Forks Engineer Band. Guess what? Very interesting. So, it's not installed, but let's install it for the funsies. Anyway, that's how you, you basically change your or customize your plane. Now, you can also customize its name and that's a little less obvious by this menu here. It's called Starduster. If you want to call it something like different, you can. And uh, we can call this one, let's say, Heavy Chicken. You know, lays heavy eggs. Right, so there's the heavy chicken. So, so that's how you customize your uh, bomber. I'm going to come back brief, very quickly back to it because uh, this picture, you don't need to create it yourself. You can actually import or basically create the picture that you just import here. And I'm going to show you how to do that in a short while. So stick around. Uh, second thing what you actually oops, can do is if you go to the recruit tab, you can come here and then you obviously since I lost the crew on the previous mission you need to basically recruit so let me just recruit some people I'm not gonna go into too much details you can review them according to their personal traits I'm just trying to fill the personnel to have a crew because this is just an example okay engineer you know navigator and a bomber okay we have them so if you go I think Think to the is it crew gear or training I have to check let me see Alice okay here on the training tab I don't think it's on the oh yeah it's on both so here are the people's names and when you can choose obviously you can customize the suit headgear etc etc but the thing that I wanted to show you really is this thing you can actually, okay, let's equip the starter set so he looks more like a, you know, gunner or something. Okay, pilot. And here you can change his first and last name, which I think it's, or maybe just the first name. Let's rename him. So let's call him Brown. I don't know if you can change the brown. Yes, you can. Then we will change his to Brown. Work. Yes, spelling, it's a thing nowadays. 
So as you can see, <clears throat> you can change the first and last name. And guys, I didn't know that until I recorded up to episode three. So in episode four, I will once again will be renaming uh, my crew from my commenters and my patrons, obviously. So if you want to hop aboard, I will be doing that. I think I'm mainly renaming from the patrons uh, that just choose to support me, but that's the case. So as you can see here, pilot, groundworks, and then you can change to whatever names you choose so desire. Right. So uh, I don't think I have enough. Do I have enough cash to equip starter flight set on all? No, I don't. Okay, let's then just do some basic customization, 110. Yes, you and I have no more cash. Well, sorry, mate. You'll have to just fly regularly. Okay, that is basically how you customize your crew. The next part of the video, I will be showing you how can you actually uh, get in terms of this bomber art and the nose art, how you can get your custom picture so you don't need to draw it yourself. So stay tuned. Okay, so we have uh, shown, and let me see now, show you, I will take this picture, which is uh, my channel logo. So let me open that one in your, you can use pretty much any image editing tool. I use Photoshop, but you can use whichever one you want. It's important that it supports translucent background, and it's because my logo here is circular. So what only thing that you want to do is you really want to resize your image to be 64 by 64 pixels so it's like this big and then you want to save it as PNG transparency on and I am gonna be calling that custom livery one because custom livery zero is the one that I've created uh, of my pilot, which you will be see shortly. Okay, let's cancel the changes. So here is the custom livery. And now this is important. You have to copy it to your C users, your name, app data, local low, then you find a runner duck, bomber crew and if you take a look here is already the pilot guy that i've made manually right so i just copy paste this one and basically you get your custom livery so let's take a look how it looks in game okay so here we are now back into the game looking at the heavy chicken uh, now I will rename it Brown Works Heavy because I mean the logo and the picture should go hand in hand. So once again you go to the livery and under the nose art remember where you had custom 1. If you select custom 2, bam, there you go. That's our logo. So it's really that simple so just under custom 2 you can select it here and now we have our own bomber which looks awesome so see that wasn't too difficult and once again guys if you like what you see let me know subscribe to my channel and support uh, me on patreon so there will be much more bomber crew let's plays coming and uh, I'll see you all in the next video. Thank you very much for watching. This is Groundworks, signing off.